Senior citizen Ben, Robert De Niro, shoots a video resume for an intern job he wants. He's responding to a flyer asking for senior citizens to apply for an internship via a video stating why they should be hired. He says he's a 70-year-old widower living a comfortable life but feels he needs to be more productive. He gets a call for an interview. The company is called, About the Fit, and is run by Jules Austin, Anne Hathaway. Originally started from her kitchen, the online clothes retailing company now has gained more than 200 employees since its founding only 18 months earlier. We first see Jules answering a customer service call from a bride complaining that her bridesmaid's dresses are the wrong color. Jules takes full responsibility, is very helpful, promises to fix the glitch and even gives her own number to the bride. She moves around in her office on a bike, rarely has time to stop and celebrate co-workers' birthdays in the office or have a complete conversation with her mother. At his interview with a series of people, Ben reveals that he used to work for a company that made phone books. The interviewer, Nat Wolf, also asks him where he sees himself in the next 10 years and then realizes the question really doesn't apply. He tells him that he did great in his interviews and video and is quite overqualified for the job. Jules's co-worker Cameron, Andrew Rannells, informs her that Ben is going to be her intern, and they had jointly agreed to the outreach program a few months ago. She asks and is advised that the minimum time for her to put up with him is six weeks, since she has to make an example. Ben takes care to dress impeccably for his first day at work. Jason, Adam Devine, shows him and three other interns, two senior citizens including Celia Watson as Doris, and a young man, Zach Pearl as Davis. While Davis sets up his table with various gadgets, Ben's table has basic stationery and a simple calculator and watch. The other employees are friendly and help him start up the computer. He is informed by Jules's assistant Becky that he has a meeting with her at exactly 3.55 p.m., and he should be prompt because there's another meeting at 4 p.m. Becky also tells him to talk fast and blink a lot, because her boss is disturbed by people who do not. In the meeting, Jules informs him